This crosstab displays sales results by month. Group the months into quarters. Name the new group Q1. Note that the columns for months 1 to 3 have been replaced by a new Q1 column at the right. Note that by grouping values for the month dimension, you've created a new variable called month plus. Edit the month plus variable to group the remaining months into quarters. All values for the month dimension have now been grouped into quarters. In some cases there may be values that you do not want to group. View the ungrouped values options. Here you can specify if you want to display ungrouped values individually or to create a separate group for them. In this example, leave the default setting. You have successfully grouped dimension values in SAP Business Objects Web Intelligence. This is the end of the tutorial.